that I'm at right now, but I'm just trying to show teams that I'm still in the shape that I was previously, uh, capable of doing everything that I was capable of before. I don't know if you, do you ever look at guys who are in the league and guys who are your size or your speed? I, like, I just, like Kirk Coleman's here today, and yeah. I, sometimes I think like, well, you know, that's, mm -hmm. he's mm -hmm. not the biggest safety in the right. world, but he was an aggressive physical guy, and he's made a career for himself, and yeah. maybe you're not the biggest guy in the world, but right. you're an aggressive <laughs> physical guy. I don't know, I mean, do you see guys like that and think, yeah, I can Oh yeah, I mean, if you look at the safeties in the NFL, like the best safeties right now aren't even above six foot. So, I mean, you got Earl Thomas, you got Jars Bird, you got Troy Palomalu. Like, none of those guys are above six foot. So, I mean, it's really, it's not really about the physical attributes. It's about, I feel like it's about how you prepare for a game, how you attack the whole situation, and you just can't, you gotta be fearless out there. How do you think for all you guys, when you get to this stage, how do you think Ohio State has prepared all of you guys for trying to take this next step in your life and in your career? Um, I feel like Ohio State is just a step down from the NFL. I mean, we got to, I would say, I would arguably say that we had the best coaches in the country. Uh, our facilities are great. Uh, I mean, we have a tough schedule. So, I mean, I feel like scouts look at, look at our schedule and our opponents and what university we come from and just, uh, the alumni base that came through here and like we really haven't let down in the NFL so far so I mean might as well keep it going. Chris I just walked up how close are you to being back a hundred percent? Uh I mean right now I'm pretty close. Uh I'm just taking it slow. I don't I don't want to really speed speed through anything and make have any uh minor setbacks because I mean I already been through a major setback. So yeah, yeah. I wanna set my set myself uh back any further so right now I'm just taking things slow trying to trying to strengthen it back up to 100% and just get back ready. What are your options for the draft meaning can you kind of like put it off till next you know what I mean what, what, what do you understand are your options in that regard about being I mean, eligible so to speak? I mean it's got this draft or none? I mean yeah, I mean yeah. as as of what I know I mean this draft is what I'm shooting for. I yeah. mean I'm pretty sure it's gonna happen. Yeah uh, are you going to work out at all between? I mean, you're, you're, what's what's sort of your plan, I guess, in that regard? Uh, right now, I mean, I'm trying uh, to set a date, set a date up with my agent, and uh, just try to get teams out here because I'm I'm trying to work out before before the draft. I'm not sure if it's going to be mid April or late April. I mean, we're still in the but process. as late as you can get it, as yeah, late as you yeah. can get it, yeah. I mean, as long as I'm 100%, I mean, I'm ready to go. I was going to say, what can you do right now? You can run, obviously, yeah, now, right? Yeah, I, I mean, can just, run. yeah, I can, how I far can, along are you, I guess? Is what I'm... I mean, right now, I'm doing everything. I'm just not really trying to push it to that to that limit to 100% right now because I'm not sure if if my ankle could take that, like, yeah. me just rushing, rushing through something right now. So, I mean, right now, like I said, I'm just taking things slow, not trying to really rush anything. Have you gotten over what happened to you, or will you ever get over what happened to you in your senior year, or is it, you know, just talk about how you kind of compartmentalize that or put that in your mind? I mean, that's that's behind me now, to be honest with you. I mean, like I said before, everything happens for a reason. I'm not I'm not quite sure why it happened just yet, but I mean, yeah. I'm pretty sure I'll figure it out sometime here soon. Chris, so the Browns are allowed to have a local players workout. Do you know anything about that? Is that in your plans? Um, I'm not sure about any any like specific workouts as of right now. Uh, like I said, I'm just working with my agent, trying to figure different things out.